Megan Thee Stallion's LA home was broken into on Thursday, with thieves making off with $300-$400k worth of the star's possessions from her bedroom, reports DMZ. The two thieves wearing hoodies and gloves are said to have smashed a glass door at the back of Megan's home to gain access, before going into the master bedroom. They are said to have stolen huge amounts of jewelry, cash and electronics during the burglary, with musician Megan, 27, not home during the incident. She later tweeted, Material things can be replaced but I'm glad everyone is safe, before adding, Hotties imp really sorry but after SNL I really gotta take a break I'm so tired, physically and emotionally. Police have not made any arrests yet but there is said to be home surveillance footage of the theft, with officers hoping to obtain more footage from neighbors. Dailymail.com has contacted representatives for Megan Thee Stallion and the LAPD for further comment. Megan is gearing up to make her SNL debut this weekend, and admitted to feeling so excited, but a little nervous. In a promo I feel like we're gonna have fun, the sweetest pie head maker told Sarah Sherman, 29, before asking the comedian if she realized she was completely naked. The Houston-based musician will be both hosting and performing on the October 15 episode of SNL. Previously, she hit the SNL soundstage alongside Chance the Rapper in 2019, and again in 2020 to perform her chart-topping hits Don't Stop and Savage. In March the LAPD told rich residents to leave their flashy jewelry at home to avoid making themselves targets to criminals as the city's violent crime wave surged. In the last year, violent robberies and smash and grab thefts have skyrocketed in Los Angeles. In some startling examples in Beverly Hills, people have had their watches and in jewelry snatched from their bodies by brazen thieves who approached them as they dined in restaurants and sidewalk cafes. Now, the LAPD is telling residents not to wear their pricey jewelry. Over the last year there has been a marked increase of armed robberies involving victims wearing expensive jewelry while in public. If it is visible, it can be a target, the LAPD statement said this week. The warning was met with incredulity from some, who asked why the police force isn't doing more to round up thieves. So we're supposed to give up everything, because they allow these criminals to walk the streets, instead of putting them in prison, where they belong. One critic said, 